and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am back doing the 10,000 calorie challenge. This was my first proper video that I did on my YouTube channel. So when I was celebrating my one year anniversary, I did it again. And it's my two year anniversary on YouTube. So I thought I would do it again. Like I honestly can't believe that it has been two years. It has honestly flown by. And before we get into the challenge, some of you might not be bothered by this, but if you're a long time viewer of mine, I just want to say a massive thank you. Since starting YouTube, so much has changed. Obviously, as you know, I have now gone part time in my job. That in itself is amazing. And I'm just so grateful that I'm still getting so much support two years on. And thank you to the people that have been here from the start. I honestly appreciate you so much. And obviously all the newcomers. <laughs> right, the 10,000 calorie challenge. First of all, if you are triggered by seeing calories or this topic, then please click out of this video. It's not worth the watch, honestly. There is going to be calories mentioned throughout I would much rather you guys think about how that could have an impact on your mental health than watch the video today so yes I thought I would just quickly say that I will also reconfirm the rules so we have 24 hours to eat 10,000 calories so I will be starting at midnight liquid calories do not count so I won't be drinking any fizzy drinks or milkshakes or anything like that I know Think that's pretty much it um yeah so my attempt today is to reach 10,000 calories I did do it the first time and I was very very close the second time so I really want to make sure I get it in the bag this time so come on get it in you girl anyway let's crack on with the video hope you guys enjoy it please 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 don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel I've said this before it's actually changed now so previously I think it was like 40% of people who watch my videos aren't subscribed it's now decreased to 35% so it is going down which is great but yeah if you're watching this video and you're not subscribed please do anyway let's see what I had at midnight I'm starting off at McDonald's it's pissing it down and the time Time is currently eight minutes to midnight on Friday the 8th of April. I'm actually going to be starting this challenge at midnight. So it's going to be Saturday the 9th of April. This is actually the first time that I've ever included fast food in my 10,000 calorie challenge. Hi, can I get the, um, uh, can I get a large big tasty meal please? What drink? Water. I'm afraid you're out of the waters. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, Diet Coke, please. Adios. No, thanks. Just whilst we're waiting for this, I have also prepared the mayonnaise in here. So I'm going to insert a clip now of me adding the mayonnaise for calories. So this was the highest calorie mayo that I could find. 102 calories. So I've put some in here. All right, here it is, 25 grams. Here's 169 calories. Okay, you tell Thank you. And can I get two sweet and sour sauces, please? Okay, shitty lighting, but we roll. The rest of the video won't be like this. If I have a bite, does that mean yeah, it's no. incomplete? Yeah. And you've never, he's never had a big tasty before. Oh, no. What? They're not good chips. They're not even slightly crispy. Did you hear this? No. This is why I told you what McDonald's we should go to. Okay. I'm going to take you there one day, and you're... When I lived at my mum and dad's, that's the only McDonald's I'll eat at, so... Oh, I also just want to say a couple of things about the, today's challenge. Firstly, when I've done this before, some people commented saying, you can't start at midnight. If you go asleep, it doesn't count. It's 24 hours, It's 24 yeah. hours. How can, you not, how can you consume 10,000 calories in the 24 hours without sleeping? If I want to have a nap midway through, oh, then what, yeah, if anything, that makes it harder. You're cutting time out. Mm -hmm. And then the next thing is, yes, I definitely will be following the liquid calories don't count, but spreads and sauces do count because they're in the food. If sauces don't count, then am I supposed to subtract the big tasty sauce from this? No. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Alright guys, there's no chips in the bottom of the bag. There's literally nothing left in there. No, start rubbing your finger around in there. And get it all <laughs> no. up. Complete. So I already worked out the um, total because obviously I had some time on my hand to keep me awake. To confirm, it's 12 minutes past. So I'm at 1,412 calories. I'm not going to sleep until I've had 2,000 calories. So time to go home and fill my boots. What do you have? I'm gonna have some, you'll see in a minute. <laughs> First thing I'm going to start on is these. These are the crispy coated nuts 
and then the sweet chili flavor. Someone who watches my videos always says the Tesco ones are really good. I'm gonna weigh out 50 grams. I'll show you all the calories after. I've eaten all these things that I'm gonna eat now. All right, I'm doing 70 grams of these. I like to distract myself when I'm eating. If I go to hospital. How many calories are there in a hospital meal? <sighs> yes! <laughs> Fucking hell, whip the neighbours up. Ew! What? Why did that taste weird? Um, That's all it's... the food I ran on the carpet. I yeah! <laughs> Where's that acid? Probably just straggly air all over it. Probably. Probably the carpet cleaner for I'm always spilling my <laughs> Pepsi Max. <laughs> Can I just pick you say quite a as well. It is. Can I just say that it's good to get nuts in early because chewing becomes tedious in the ten thousand calorie challenge. So Oh there's still one left. I thought I was done. That was not enjoyable. I didn't like it then. I'm just gonna guzzle some water and then I'm gonna finish on something sweet. I'm gonna finish my midnight feast with one of these. It's a sticky toffee pudding and this has 362 calories. This is gonna be really hot. Also, my boyfriend just had one at the same bowl to save one bomb washing in case you're wondering what's on it. So yeah, whilst I wait for that to cool down, I'm actually gonna have one of these because I've got it in me to eat two more things. So this is 235 calories. Completed it. I think you Final bite. It. Mate, I think you smashed it. You held your own today, mate. I feel like my face has gone spotty. My teeth feel furry. I thought I was going to chunder for a minute then. Um, are you joking? Are you joking? Look how much I've eaten. You've had a McDonald's and a fucking yoghurt. And a sticky toffee pudding and those nuts. Those nuts were not it. Anyway, so anyway, we are now on 2,409 calories and the time is two minutes to one. So we're 58 minutes into the challenge and I'm a quarter of a way through. I'll make it sound easy, bro. But right, I'll see you in the morning. It is currently 25 past seven on the 9th of April and I am going to have some craves. 136 calories for 30 grams i'm gonna try and eat as much as i can of this and of course i'm not counting the milk okay so we have 120 grams of this which is 532 calories also if you're new here i like to sit on the floor and eat don't ask me why i'm literally sitting in front of my sofa but no to be fair so don't ask me why but i don't actually do it normally <laughs> just when i'm filming because it's just an easy angle Anyway, I'm excited to eat these, I'm not gonna lie. I just got a message saying, you hit your protein goal for the day. <laughs> That's probably the first time it's ever said it. Anyway, I'm gonna go and have some more. I've already got some cereal. No, some milk left in my bowl, so I'm just gonna fill it up. I must be feeling brave. I've gone for another 134 grams. So I've now got 254 grams of Crave. I've had 120 and then 134. That is 1,122. No, 1,126. At the bottom there. Alright, that's them all gone. Not a crave in sight. So I'm going to take a break. I'm currently at 3,535 calories and it's quarter to eight. I feel like I've messed up a little bit. It's half past ten. I feel bad to sleep. But you need your sleep, you know. This is a this is a big day. So I got some extra thick bread because it's obviously higher in calories. One slice is 140. So I'm going to start with two slices. So that'll be like 280. And then obviously I'm going to love this in lure pack because lure pack is so high. I hate doing calories with stuff like lure pack. I literally just had a dream that I was doing this. She thick. Okay, so I've used 30 grams of lure pack. As you can see, I've tried to put quite a bit on. Most of it's melted now. I need to go to M&S and Greg's after this. Oh my God, lure pack is the best. Guess how many calories 30 grams was? 212. So my current calories are 400, no. 4,027. Now, I just want to quickly point something out. This is never ever to my, that I've realised 
happened on my fitness pal before the only things i've added in literally all day is under breakfast right so you can see under breakfast it says three eight something but then the total is four something so i earlier on i removed everything and when i removed everything there was nothing there and it still said i'd had four 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 calories which is the size of a large chip so it's like there's a lot i did the large chips on there so if i added so i've removed the large chips <laughs> if i added the large chips on it would say i'm 400 in front but i'm not so this is this is uh, well this is the correct total because even though it says that it's calculating some chips that are not shown on the screen just in case anyone realizes that i've just been on a greg's and mns run i've got a few things from greg's and i'm going to see how many i can chow down i'm not going to put the calories in now because i need to actually check the greg's website so i will put on screen now how many calories the first thing i'm eating is which is the cheese and bacon wrap thing mm, that's good today time lapse again That was actually quite easy. The thought of it, I was like, Ugh. right, next thing from Greg is oh, less sausage roll. Right, come on, gal. Let's do this. I'll admit that one wasn't as easy. I've got one more thing, so I'm just gonna get it out of the way because when I get in, I wanna do my makeup. So that's gonna, you know, take up some time. Right, so we have something sweet now. Again, I will put this on the screen. Um, I don't know the total calories now. So once I've finished this, I'll let you know the total so far. Final bite. I've just been watching some YouTube, by the way, in case you thought I was just like staring like a possessed person. I think I should have a named parking spot here. I'm gonna write to Lakeside and say, can you like, do you know what I mean, VIP parking? <laughs> anyway, totals are on the screen now. I reckon I should be at 5,000. My car is covered in flaky pastry. Fabulous, darling. Worst thing for me to eat in the car. But I hate eating all at home because it's so boring just washing me in my flat. But yeah, so as I said, halfway there. Cue the song. Oh, I'm such a loser. <laughs> so the time is currently just gone two o'clock. So quite a bit later, I feel like I'm going to be a little bit behind now, but this part of the video, I'm actually going to be trying all new stuff because I'm actually going to do a TikTok as well. So don't forget to follow me on TikTok if you don't already. <laughs> I mean, it's not too exciting over there. I, um, I don't post regularly. Sometimes I post like four in a week and then I just don't post for ages. But I do post like little what I eat in a days and stuff over there. So yeah, I thought it'd be cool to include some new bits. Let me just quickly do the taste test on TikTok. If you wanna get my opinion on these, <laughs> head over to the TikTok and then I'll just eat the rest on here. I need to, shall I show you the bits I've got actually? So first of all, this is the 12 slash breakaway, the mint one from B&M. My mum picked me these up and these are, both the sticks is 176. Then this is the cookie collusion. But all of this is 240 calories. I'm gonna have some crunchy watsits. Now I don't think these will be that great for calories. So I'm just gonna have 30 grams of these. 164 calories for 30 grams. And then I picked up these. Tony Coloni's extra special chocolate eggs. I'm gonna have six of these and they are 280 calories for six. So there's all different flavors, but I'm gonna try like the cool flavors. We'll be back with you guys in a minute. I just tried two of these, really good. A quarter of this, one of these. And well, I still measured that 30 grams even though I ate two of these, so. But yeah, these are quite heavy, so they're quite good. But I didn't rate these. No wonder why I haven't really heard much about them, but they do not compare to the flaming hot giant watsies at all. I always say this though, when I've eaten a lot, I always feel like potentially it could bland the flavors, but these weren't bland. Anyway, I'm feeling kind of sick. I've barely eaten anything in this sitting. Oh, no, one left. <laughs> I really don't know if I can finish the rest of this Kit Kat. I don't really like it. It's n no, it's not that I don't like it, it's just, it's not me and i'd really i'd rather be spending my calories on something else so i'm gonna finish half so i'll remove half of the thing and then i'm just gonna eat one more of these because i put in the thing that i'll have free
that now means that my total is only 5661 and it's half two. Let me take a break. This lot has made me feel sick. I'll be back by three. It is literally three minutes to three. As I said, you'll see me before three. So I picked one of these up in MS. These are 326 calories, which brings my total up to 5996. Just shy of 6,000. Huh? I've still got plenty of time to go. <laughs> I had to stand up eating that because final bite. It's time to get in the game. I am now going to have, if you've watched my calorie challenges before, you know that these are a must. MS's croissants. Now, when I went to pick them up today, these are bakery ones, by the way, I thought, wow, these are definitely bigger than they have ever been before. So I double checked the calories, luckily, because they've gone up. They used to be 321 and now they're 386. So, two of them. 386 one of them i'm gonna have savory one of them i'm gonna have sweet i'm gonna put butter in both because i can't no it, it needs butter i'm gonna have one ham and cheese and i'm gonna have one nutella the amount of calories that this will rack up is unbelievable we've got 22 grams of butter by the way if you place it on there at zero as you're taking it out it'll tell you how much you're using Thanks to the people that taught me that in the last calorie challenge. <laughs> so the butter's on. We've got 44 grams of cheese. And we've also got three slices of ham on this. So I'm just going to put the cheese on here. I'm going to melt this one first so that the cheese is all melted properly. I'm going to do the other one with Nutella. Sorry, don't butter your toast. It's a fresh jar, by the way. If you don't butter your toast before you put Nutella on, then I'm going to try and get in as much Nutella as possible without it being too sickly. Right, so it's at zero. And that's 50 grams of Nutella. Yas. Ham and cheese croissants are one of my favourite things ever. So I should be excited to eat this, but I'm kind of also like, <sighs> nope. I'm excited, right? Mm. Mm. Time stamp, by the way. I'll run through the calories once I've finished. The thing is, you think that you'll have a bit of appetite, but because you're just eating so much, you fill up so quickly. Ugh. Anyway, one down, one to go. I'm struggling bad, but the fact that this bit here, just this much, holds so many calories. To remove off the count is not worth it. I'm gonna force feed myself this. I'm not leaving this bit of table till I've finished. Okay, I lied. I'm gonna have a break. I've taken a breather and I'm just gonna quickly get this down without thinking about it. And then I'm gonna have a nap, I think. My total calories are now, it's 20 to five, and we are at 7,405. That felt like a mammoth, mammoth task. <laughs> right, I'll see you in a bit. The time is now quarter to six, and I'm gonna have some strawberry pop tarts and for two of these basically one pack so each one is 186 calories which is crazy so yeah for two of these it will be 372 calories and then i've got these m s loaded millionaires and these are 99 each so whilst i'm making them or should i say put it in putting it in the toaster i have three of these which will then take me to 8074 at six o'clock Easy work. I like work. Them brownies are so good, aren't they? Mm-hmm. Bit sickly. Nah. I'll just see if the whole bowl. Oh yeah, I've got no doubt you'd do that. Number two, I'm just gonna one bite it because I need to see to get it down. Number three. I feel like I've eaten a lot of snacks, so I do kind of want to end the day with a yeah, meal. You need, that's what I'm saying. You need a fucking Taco Bell? Ooh, it's been a minute still. Taco Bell isn't that high in calories. No, I wouldn't. I'd have to eat quite a few things. That's what I'm saying, like about pizza or something. I could not eat a pizza, I'm telling you now. Looks like I've got no lips, everyone, sorry. Yeah, what was you finish slagging me off? I wasn't slagging you off, I'm <laughs> stating facts. Ha oh, ha. I like the raspberry ones, I don't know if I've had these ones. What ones are they? Strawberry. Shout out to Hannah Marlin doing the 10,000 calorie challenge. <laughs> this is not nice. I've burnt it, as you can see, and it's just really dry and hard work, so I'm not going to eat it. 
eat it. So I've taken it off the calories and instead, one minute. They better not be them 18 notes. They are, aren't they? How much are they? 18 pounds. You're joking me. I'm being serious. We can't afford that with, with the prices of living going up. Yeah, so it's these... It's either you eat them or you afford to heat, the, <laughs> heat your flat yeah. for a month. Yeah, so these cost 18 pounds, but what you do They doesn't... don't, don't wind me up. I'm <laughs> going to have to Google it. <laughs> You like better not They do. Is... And they come in the glass containers. Obviously, you're paying for two glass containers. These are 328 calories you're for such one. A liar. <laughs> I've been lying to him for months about what I was just saying then, and you believe me. You well, did yeah. believe me because you were mad Obviously, when I said. Yeah, no, there's no trust in the relationship. <laughs> Why does it look like there's so much biscuit in it? Well, that's the best bit. Like a chundavanda. <laughs> What one did we have before? What was it? The goo one when you actually, you're right there. It was Zillionaire shortbread. Oh yeah. That's why I said to you and I was like, it's got gold flakes in it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, You took me for a fool. <laughs> and he was like, give me up and I go and return them. <laughs> Guys, I finished this. So now my calories are 8,224 and it's six o'clock. So it's time for dinner. I wanted something that felt a little bit like healthy-ish. <laughs> I don't know if it's actually gonna work because it's probably a lot more filling than like chicken brow or something. But this is my current setup. We have gone for Nando. So I've got some scales here so I can weigh out some mayo. <laughs> my, my rings have come off because you know I mean business. This is what I actually use as a tripod. Um, this Easter egg from 2021 and a Diet Coke. Now I know what you're thinking. You think, oh, and the food. <laughs> Let me just quickly go back to the Diet Coke situation. You're probably thinking, Hannah, why are you filling up on fizzy drinks? Because I want to, okay? Anyway, I have gone for the Fino Pitta, which has chicken thighs, halloumi, chutney, garlic sauce, and chips. Since the new legislation has gone out that places have to state their calories, although I understand the impact of putting calories on menus and what impact that might have on people. I'll actually leave the petition to remove the calories in the description box. So sign that if that's something that you agree with. But for the point of this video, it actually come in handy because the Fino Pitta is 817 calories and chips are 450. And then I'm gonna start off with 20 grams of mayo. I've got 21 grams of mayo. I'm sorry, for reference, it's currently half past eight. I'm not gonna tell you the completed calories because I really do need to finish this first, but I'll put you guys in a time lapse. Wish me luck. Oh. done it look what i'm no, at 900 and six i mean 9632 that was a real struggle but i think because it doesn't have as much grease in as like something processed it was probably probably actually easier for me to eat it right so i've got hours still left because i got till midnight i need something that's 368 calories i reckon i could put back some ice cream yeah, you get some ice cream in here. Not now. I am looking dishevelled. I need to finish this bleeding video. It is 20 to 10. I am finishing the day. Ben and Jerry's half baked. 368 calories to 10,000. So if I have 140 grams, as you can see at the bottom here, that will give me 370, which will take my total to 10,002. <laughs> Let's get this weighed and get this over with. Right, here it is, guys. 149 grams of ice cream to finish the challenge. Here we go, here we go, here we go. <laughs> right, I actually can't believe I'm here. When it got to about six notes when I had the croissants, that's when I was like, I'm not completing this today. I feel disgusting. But I pulled through. <laughs> I feel like the savoury dinner saved me there. I couldn't have done a lot because I had all cookies and stuff. Like if I'd have had 
any more cookies or if I had to have the last 2,000 in sweet stuff, I wouldn't have done it. Right, let's get this down there. <laughs> It. some of you will want me to lick the bowl so I've done it I'm sorry <laughs> I'm actually so happy fuck oh, yeah the 10,000 calorie challenge is all about being smart thank you for watching today's video um as I said at the beginning this is in celebration of my two-year YouTube anniversary and again I just want to say a massive thank you for all of the support and everything over the last two years it's been amazing it's been fun and yeah i'm gonna wrap the video up i reckon it could be a long one and there's gonna have been a lot of time lapses but we made it we did it pat on the back i think this is gonna have to be the last time i do it though guys i really do because <laughs> it is not enjoyable and like it feels exciting in your head you think oh yeah i'm gonna get to eat all this good food and then when it comes to it it's like it makes you feel ill. Anyway, I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you did, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're new here. I have also got a podcast as well, so I will leave that linked in the description. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in my next one.